This is the most energy efficient building in the Okanagan Valley. The newly constructed daycare on the Okanagan College's Penticton campus is a passive house, a super energy efficient building standard originating in Germany but growing in popularity in British Columbia. This building is designed in a very compact fashion, not a lot of uh, exterior envelope. Um, and then we carefully place the windows so that we maximize our solar gains in the winter and we don't have a lot of windows on the north side which will become uh, heat loss in the winter time. Featuring ultra thick walls and airtight doors and windows, it's believed to be the first institutional passive house in the entire province. The whole center consumes just 10% of the energy of a typical home. The college spends over a million dollars a year on our utilities, so being able to reduce our operational cost was, uh, was certainly one of our driving factors. Um, we pay a little more to put the building up up front, but uh, we'll certainly save it over the long term in, in operational cost. The child care center also breaks down barriers for students that otherwise might not be able to attend the college. There's a, definitely a, a, a shortage of daycare spaces available in Penticton, so if you're a, a student and you're, you're trying to, to find some place to put your children so you can, you can attend college, uh, it's, a, it, it's, it's sometimes a barrier. The concept has been at least six years in the making and is operated by the Penticton and District Community Resources Society. Yeah, so we opened our doors in September and we started with 32 children. We're now serving 37 kids. Our goal is to reach 48 children by January and we're going to be there. Uh, that's our full license capacity. Uh, the need in our community was, uh, was child care for younger kids, so infants and toddlers, so kids under three. So that starts to impact uh, the group sizes you have and the child ratios you have with adults and children. So the most kids we can serve right now are 48, but in the future, and when those kids grow up and they become four and five year olds, we, this building can actually serve up to 64. The building was constructed with provincial funding and a $700,000 fundraising campaign from the Okanagan College Foundation. For Castanet in Penticton, I'm Colin Dacre. Castanet has webcams, and lots of them. Click the cams button in our yellow masthead to see them all.